Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel and to another part of Honkai Star Rail. Patch 1.2 is here and of course we are going through the story more of the Sienjo Law Fu. I was doing my stagnant shadow so don't don't mind me standing here but we are going back to the main quest Desolated Depths of Despair to see what awaits us in this patch. The trailer was amazing. If you haven't seen it, check it out on my channel. I will link it somewhere. Yeah, and I would say we will start into this playthrough of patch 1.2. As always, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and leave a like on the video. And I would say we will start right away. Let's go. Back to the Sienjo Love. I can't really remember too well where we left off. Except for the point that it was like, I don't know, in the middle of something. In the middle of nowhere, I guess. Like, really in, in between. Oh yeah, we fought the deer. Here, Creation Furnace. The creation furnace provides energy to the artisan ship commission and ensures its normal operation. Okay. We will see. Kafka and Blade are also on the run. I don't know where they went, but we will find out eventually. <laughs> eventually we will find out. Okay. Alchemy Commission. Oh, it looks bad. <laughs> oh, I love these dogs or whatever these are. Uh, whoa, looks like the battle here was intense. Hmm. The Master Diviner must have launched the campaign while we were delayed in the Artisanship Commission. She must have divided it was the right time. I can't imagine Fu Shuan obeying orders to the word. Hmm. I don't know. Time is of the essence. The most important task for the Xianzhou Law Fu is suppressing the Stellaron. Hmm, true, true, true. General Jing Yuan tasked the Master Diviner with commanding the Cloud Knights. He would have known she'd act on the results of her divination. Thank goodness the General didn't make us go with the Knights. Fighting is totally different from adventuring. All these people. It's tough to bear. I mean, that's true. But we are still fighting, even though we are travelers, right? I'm afraid this is nothing, Benefactor. Mm. Centuries ago, an emanator of abundance besieged the Lafu with the aim of taking the Ambrosial Arbor. They destroyed half our delves and killed most of the Cloud Knights. For long life species, such events are more like yesterday's mm. memories than ancient history. This awful spectacle is child's play in comparison. I guess she's right. Hey, is that supposed to make us feel better? <laughs> I just can't with March. It's hard to tell if the Master Diviner won or lost here. Hmm. I think she won total victory. Seems to me her troops were wiped. Let's play it safe and say it was a draw. A draw? This isn't a tournament, you know. I can't see many cloud knights. The Sienjo must have fought well. Mm. Not necessarily. True. There'd usually be a base with supporting forces set up after a successful engagement, but we don't see any of that. Well, knows quite much about how the Sienjo Law Fu works. Let's look around and see if we can find some clues. Hmm. Be careful. Those monsters are pretty tough. They are look, all dead. There's someone over there. Wait, wait, wait. Let me take a look around. <laughs> Oh, it's just a random person. <laughs> oh, treasure. I currently reached Trailblaze level 60. 
I know I'm quite late here. with that. There are still survivors here. <clears throat> You're not the knights. What is your purpose here? It's dangerous. We're reinforcements sent by the general. Where's everyone else? <laughs> Resorting to short life species as reinforcements. <laughs> Jing Yuan is truly running out of options. <laughs> Run! She's a disciple of Sanctus Medicus! Oh. Silence. If my healing worked, you'll become one of us. Oh my, oh my god. And then it's not just me they'll be running from. Hurry! Okay. Leave here! Wait, that's him? I can't control myself anymore! He's the moment. The music is amazing. <laughs> Lend me your strength. Eternal sleep, the dead return. What a headache. What? <laughs> <laughs> Receive divinity. Huh. Better late than never. Seize the moment. Yeah. The lives of short life species Ooh. are so fleetingly brief. Where I love Why these monsters. <laughs> Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. What the hell? Let's be friends. No. <laughs> You'll pay for this. <laughs> you chose the wrong enemy. Bloom. <sighs> Better late Don't than mess never. With me. <laughs> Who's next? <laughs> We've Would be nice if we had like an, an AoE wind damage dealer like play. Crush them. But since my pity is very low and I don't have any more <laughs> gems, I need to, you know. Wait a little bit to get like more gems. Imprisonment. I mean, I have already cost them to like the healing style of Blue Watcher, and I really enjoy it now. Receive the divinity. I guess I need to kill the white Eternal one first sleep, the dead because they are summoning so the other are ones. Of me. Who's next? Let's just this focus on this boy. Lend me your strength. This is, by the way, my favorite team so far. <laughs> I thought that it might be a problem that I haven't reached level your 80 with my characters timely. yet. Which kind of sucks. <laughs> and now I'm under level. <laughs> Because I was slacking off in the beginning. This battle is un <laughs> We've entered the storm. To guard come on, but we can do it. Why did you come to the <laughs> no. To seek immortality. You don't Are you have for to real? Jing Wen. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus can provide strength. all that you desire. You off. No. <laughs> to guard and defend. I mean, Crush even if them. I do like to be immortal, you know, I don't really. I mean, the characters don't came. The, the characters didn't come here for like getting immortality. You know what I mean? <laughs> you chose the wrong enemy. <laughs> <laughs> Defense. Let's see if Disappear I can go through the, the whole patch with level 17. Of the past. <laughs> or if I'm going to struggle. <laughs> let's see, let's see. Oh, hold on. We'll find someone to help. Don't waste your time. <laughs> They've converted me. I don't have much longer. Go. The Master Diviner's troops are ahead. He stops talking. It could be because he is exhausted or he's waiting for you to leave him be. Let's go. 
It's like so crazy the that they are. The disciples were in hiding for so long. Now they finally show their face. Sure, sure, sure. Did the Master Diviner fail to foresee this? Be careful, benefactors. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus worship Yaoshit, the plague's author, the greatest enemy of the Sienjo. The Alliance has been trying to root out their secret organization for millennia. It's okay. no coincidence that they've chosen this moment to reveal themselves. Mm, true, true, true. And I was a fan of the abundance. <laughs> Seventy six, bro. Everyone is just like seventy six. What a headache! I really am going to struggle There's here, right? Lend me your strength. Okay, but I think it's okay. It just takes a little bit longer to get Eternal through, sleep, the dead but we can still make it. <laughs> I just need Bronya. Lance ablaze! Lance forward! We can do it. We can do it. I'll free you from disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. <laughs> A sharp scythe needs targets. I don't know, but I think the bosses will be like level 80. <laughs> so it's not going to be easy. Entered safe zone, okay. We are safe for now. These are the troops of Fu Xuan. Who goes there? Show yourselves. I'm still a little bit confused why no one knows us. They should know that we are working with the general, right? Wait, it's you. Quickly, in here. It's dangerous outside. Oh, okay, so they recognize us. You recognize us? Are you not the general's guests? Sure. The Master Diviner prophesied your arrival. We were okay. ordered to wait for you under any circumstances. Wu Xuan was here. Yes, the Master Diviner ordered us to remain stationed here and went to scout ahead, okay. saying the disciples of Sanctus Medicus have returned. Mm. They haven't been seen for an age. The troops are anxious. Mm, of course. It's good that you're here. The Master Diviner said the knights weren't to move out until you arrived. Okay, why? Please wait in the camp. We'll decide on our next steps once the Master Diviner returns. Wu Xuan. That the Cloud Knights received orders not to advance is a bad sign. The Disciples of Sanctus Medicus. I've heard the name before. If memory serves, they're an underground sect of the Abundance that's said mm. to have lain dormant within the Sienjo, plotting to overthrow the Alliance. Mm, true, true, true. The Stellaron has certainly caused Abundance-like abnormalities, is that what motivated the disciples to come out of the shadows? Maybe? No. No. The knight's main force remains intact. Something must have happened. Something we're not aware of. The master diviner isn't here. Let's head into camp and see what we can learn from the troops here. Good idea. Why don't you take a look around, benefactors? Okay. My feet need a rest. Hmm? But what can possibly be happening? I mean, Jing Liu is here, right? As well. I saw her in the companion quest. Oh. Have you talked with these disciples, Benefactor? What do you make of them? Not yet. Why would they betray the Lafu? I don't understand. I don't know, since I'm not a resident of the Lafu. I don't really know why is there a robot dragon tree wait what the sturdy and thick trunk of the ancient tree rises upward wait wait, wait i can't read 
You have heard of the myth about trees in some worlds being ancient spirits that can talk and think they will awaken when there is a crisis and unleash nature's might. Could this be a tree like this? The most well-known landmark of Alchemy Commission's healer market is an ancient tree with dragon-like intertwining roots. Okay. Okay, let's talk to them. There is a gas ghastly paleness in the face of this resident cloud knight. As you approach him, he nods his head in salute. Forgive me for being brief. Salute. <laughs> Warfare is a dangerous business. There's no time for idle chat. How's the situation? We took over this place a few hours ago under the Master Diviner's command. It was only afterwards that we learned our enemies were none other than the disciples of Sanctus Medicus, those who worship the plagues author. Everything was going as planned. The sorcerers of the disciples and the fantastic creatures they commanded were no match for us. Okay. And... After a while, our comrades suddenly started to slaughter one another. Mm. They became Mara struck. There's a wounded warrior that didn't make it back to, this to his unit. Curse it. What Sanctus Medicus sorcery did they use on us? The greatest fear of the Sienjo people is succumbing to our Mara struck form around others. Mm. To do so means that we have given up on being human. Lost the abomination sleeping in our immortal blood and violated the rainbow's admonishments. Hmm. What the disciples of Sanctus Medicus did are despicable acts that every Alliance resident detests. I swear to the Arbiter that I will avenge my comrades. So, that must be really scary because if one of these disciples is in their roles, they are just turning everyone into Mara Struck soldiers right that's crazy hello you captured the cyber a cloud knight standing next to the captive he steps aside after you explain your identity and show him the general's order you want to ask questions uh, uh, fine but i must be present the whole way through it's okay this part needs to be recorded as testimony. Mm. <laughs> Finally, someone to talk to. These cloud knights are so serious, so boring. <laughs> About that shining seed? <laughs> I've seen it. So beautiful. If you gaze into it, there's a voice inside that speaks to you. Okay. Do you still remember Kakolia? Mm. <laughs> the master said we could inject new life into the ambrosial arbor with it. <laughs> I didn't believe it at first. We tried many methods, spending multiple lifetimes of short life species. Yet the arbor showed no signs of resurrection. But the Stellaron in Beloborg was actually not what the will of the preservation was, right? So maybe what these people do is not what the abundance wa wants. But look upon it now. <laughs> Only the power of an eon can recreate the miracle. Yes, yes, the mighty Sanctus Medicus, the abundance. Okay, he's crazy. About the Ambrosial Arbor. So you witnessed it too? The Ambrosial Arbor's resurrection. <laughs> Magnificent. That was the tree, right? They have like weird names for some stuff and then I get confused. But I think that was the, the tree that was growing all of a sudden. In the Befall era, so far in the past that even long life species cannot recall. Sanctus Medicus, the Abundance, gifted the Ambrosial Arbor to the Sienjo Lofu. Okay. With that sacred tree, humanity realized many miracles. The fallow earth... The western soap berry, the altered flesh, but that devilish archer ruined everything. Mm. They twisted right and wrong and erased Sanctus Medicus's achievements. But soon, soon we will return to the glory of the Befall era. <laughs> You've seen the fantastic creatures that fought with us. They are only minor gifts of the Ambrosial Arbor. Shut it, rambling rodent. Mm? The Cloud Knights will root all of you out soon. Mm, what did you do to this Cloud Knight? What did we do? 
We cured our kin. <laughs> it must hurt to be trapped in such weak flesh and blood. But why are the Sanctus Medicus people not Mara struck? Why do they not infuse themselves to become Mara struck? You scum! If the order allowed, I would cut you down now. Hmm? Oh, you don't understand. A short life species couldn't understand. Mara struck? Bah. It's a second life gifted by Sanctus Medicus. To eliminate the self, to achieve transcendence, a life of true freedom. Then why are you not Mara struck? What the fuck? That's what I'm not understanding. Why are these people not Mara struck themselves if they like say it's a gift? Then Mara struck yourself, bro. I see a desire for power in your eyes. This life is too short for you, isn't it? <laughs> I can... I can help you. I can help you too with, like, killing you. Don't listen. His words are poison. It's okay. I... I'm not infected by that. We're just having fun, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Without the blessing of the abundance, you short-life species would never be able to endure the transformation. I... I don't want it. <laughs> what the fuck? What is happening? I don't have any more questions. Yeah. Master because... Diviner, you're back. Oh, Fu Xuan. I have kept you waiting, but the deceit of the disciples is laid bare to me now. You kept us waiting all right. Why didn't you tell us about the disciples of Sanctus Medicus earlier? Please tell us the whole truth this time. Apologies. To avoid dissemination of intelligence, the General and I kept the involvement of the Disciples to ourselves. It's okay, just tell me now. I love her character design. She's so cute. It is a clandestine organization that seeks to overthrow the Alliance. Before the Stellaron disaster, the Disciples have remained veiled in shadow for years. Their emergence reflects their intricate connection to this calamity. The conflict is difficult, Master Diviner, but you have led your forces from the front lines and beyond in pursuit of the enemy. Admirable work. Hardly. A Diviner must acquire first-hand knowledge in order to calculate the future. Collecting intelligence in this way assists me in achieving the right answer. Hmm. Wait, what's all this about a difficult conflict? The Disciples of Sanctus Medicus have been scheming for a long time, but our army is in no way inferior. How can things be so difficult? Is this as... What, what is that word? Say, wait, let me look that up. Move without interruption. Oh, like the segue? Okay. An uninterrupted transition from one piece of music or film scene to another. Okay. Just ask for her, our help already. And to join in this. Oh, okay. Okay. I understand now. Ask us. It would seem you came prepared. Hmm. The first time we met Madame Yukong, she said something like, This is a Sienjo affair, and there's no need for the Express to get involved. Why are you mad? We are here for for the Stellaron. How can we not get involved? <laughs> and now here we are running around doing everything. Even the IPC takes it easier on us. Mm. Oh, let me guess. What are we up to this time? Could it be heading to the front lines? Leading the Cloud Knight charge? <laughs> well, try this on for size. Nope. I can't stand any more of this fighting. So there. Then leave. Where's Don Hong? <sighs> Who said you'd be heading to the battlefield? Uh, we're not? Jing Yuan's orders. He said that the value of unexpected guests lies in the unexpected. The Cloud Knight's assault was to demonstrate our power to the enemy head on. Now it is time for the unexpected. Okay. Please, come with me. Time for the unexpected. 
After receiving the Ambrosial Arbor, the Alchemy Commission was once the Lafu's most vital commission. After all, it was they who changed the Sienjo natives into long-life species. They also developed many incredible technologies from the tree itself. Okay. But in the end, the alchemist grew discontented and began to obsess over the manipulation of life. Research into the arbor poisoned their minds. Mm. The more they pursued it, the more they longed for it. Mm. Okay. Yeah, that's the deal with like wisdom and power, right? Some people e want more and more. Evening mist gathers around me. Do you see that? Morning bells shim in a dream, evening mist get up around. Okay. What huge elixir crucibles. There's still smoke coming out of them. This is where the alchemists practiced the way of immortality in ancient times. They erected elixir crucibles here to absorb the power of the arbor, turning fantasy into reality. Since the smoke from the crucibles never ceases, this place was named Eve Mist Mansion. Okay. An elegant name, but as far as the art of war is concerned, it's a death trap. As long as the crucibles are lit and the smoke continues to linger, we cannot get any closer. Did you try to get closer? I'm just asking, <laughs> you know. This is why the Cloud Knights lost control and became Mara struck? Indeed. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus infuse the smoke that permeates this delve with medicinal pellets that elicit Mara. Unless the Cloud Knights were able to march with their breath held, they would be doomed to fall into disarray. Moreover, no one can know whether their comrade was about to be stricken with Mara. Is there anything better than fear for destroying the morale of an army? Mm. The Cloud Knight's first assault was just a cover. You're using the main army to attract the enemy's attention, while we douse the elixir crucibles and stop the smoke. But how when we can't get close? The disciples of Sanctus Medicus renounced their century of secrecy and chose to reveal themselves, meaning they feel confident of victory. But no matter how well prepared they may be, their focus has always been the Cloud Knights. They are completely unaware of your existence and capacity, and in short, cannot be prepared against you. The smoke can't affect us. Why not get the foxins and bit? Vid Yadara try to try. It can affect us. Indeed. This demonic vapor is a weapon targeted against the Cloud Knights. <laughs> how how can the smoke tell the difference? The Ambrosial Arbor is taboo for the La Fu, and the Sian Zhou Alliance has always been fiercely independent. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus can never have guessed that the general would seek outside help. They won't be prepared against short life species. Oh, because that's the difference. Okay, I get it. I was just. Huh? Because not everyone understands your law who is a cloud knight, right? But it makes a difference if there are long short species and we are short life species. Is this what General Jing Yuan meant by unexpected guests? Hmm, I wouldn't probably. hazard a guess. All I can say is that the predictions of the Stellaron hunters were more accurate than mine. The future hmm. that Kafka seeks is becoming reality. One step at a time. What is the future that she seeks? I don't want to act according to the predictions. This is the only way. <sighs> I hate predictions of the future, you know. I mean, actually... I think they are kind of useful, but if you have seen like movies where they like know about the future and they try to avoid the future, then the future that they are trying to avoid actually happens. So it's better to not know and just do whatever. Hmm? I do not wish to be their puppet either. In any case, hmm. we do not walk alone and unhindered on our paths. Our choices define us and influence others. 
Mm. The duty of the Master Diviner is to bring luck and avoid misfortune. I don't want my choice to plunge the Lafu into a terrible future. But if we don't do anything, the terrible future will come either way, so... To return to the matter at hand, only you can douse the Elixir Crucibles without being harmed by them. What say you? Okay. <sighs> Fine. I didn't hear a please, but... Seeing as we do kind of have superpowers around here, Mr. Yang, what do you think? Why do they not say like trailblazer or friend or I don't know. Even the kids address me as like big sister, but I don't know. It's it's kind of weird. I will come at once when the smoke dissipates. You won't be left to fend for yourselves. It doesn't give a feeling that the trailblazer is actually part of this, you know what I mean? Ushuan. She is coming soon. Oh, she has like clouds here. Wait, is she wearing something? That's not her skin, right? Huh. I feel like even though long life species get to live forever. They aren't so different from us short life species when it comes to worries and suffering. That's true. Oh, that's an elevator. I was just... Okay, never mind. But there are monsters. Oh, wait, okay. Miss Ting Yoon! Why are you still here? You're too close to the crucible! Thank you for the concern, but I'm fine. The general commanded me to stay with you. I dare not go against military orders. Wait, so she's okay? Your life is more important, Miss Tingyun. Yeah. Go back. We can explain to the general. True, true. <laughs> there is really no need. I've spent my years traveling the universe. Not to mention, I'm younger and stronger than I look. Even you benefactors have probably lived longer than me. We do? Seems like the smoke is getting thinner. Not thin enough. We need to hurry. Will of preservation! Weakness. We want to see what I the storm. I already got like idolins for Sunshine. It is, that is the only luck I I had. Oh, we need to kill that first. Oh, that was bad. I think like Otto is a pretty good healer, but I actually wish that I had like Bailu because in situations like this where I'm like under leveled or in the simulated universe, it would be nice if I have at least one possibility to revive character. <laughs> That would be awesome. What a headache. What? I'll end your misery. Wait, they are not recovering from the Maros spot. Illusions of the past. Lend me your strength. I'll see you off. <laughs> Lance ablaze. Lance forward. Don't mess with me. Yeah. You'll pay for this. Mm, I'm thinking about... Do I have like an ice character? I could use Chepard, but Chepard is level 60. So... You chose the wrong enemy. It's not actually <laughs> a possibility. <laughs> Take Chepard instead of the trailblazer. Hmm. Reach the end of the story in your own way. Okay, close it. Oh god, we are going to fight here, right? Can I like see somewhere what I need? Let's eat this. And then show your courage. Do this. Let's wait. And do and this. See. And let's go. So you succeeded in dowsing the elixir cauldrons. Unimportant. The inevitable is already upon us. Wait, she's the master? Oh boy, she... 
That's a nice character design. Dan Shu. Who's your end? It's you. Dan Shu? Wait, do we know Dan Shu? I have met you before in my capacity as chief alchemist, master diviner. You don't seem surprised. Okay, but she's actually pretty conscious for like a Mara struck person. Indeed. The general and I knew that the disciples of Sanctus Medicus must be hiding in the Alchemy Commission. However, without evidence, we couldn't bring charges before the commissions. We had to wait for you to show yourselves. Wasn't Danshu the one from Bailu's character quest? No, it was not. Who was Danshu again? And now your charges are many. Drawing Stellaron spirits into the Sienjo. Resurrecting the Ambrosial Arbor. Striking down our people with Mara. The Ten Lords Commission will address these transgressions during your reckoning. Crimes? If I am guilty, then all of our Sienjo ancestors are also guilty. They were the ones who accepted the blessings of the Abundance and turned their descendants into long life species. Hmm. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus are only walking on the road our ancestors once took. How is it a crime to seek ascendance? In days of old, the roots of the Ambrosial Arbor enveloped the Sienjolofu like a living creature. We controlled the stellar seas, and none could stand in our way. Everyone could become celestial and shift form at will. Okay. Divine miracles descended onto all nine Sanjo ships. What a glorious time that was. How far the Sanjo has fallen. We consent to be commanded by the devilish archer. Suffer continuously at the hands of the denizens of abundance. And the Ten Lords Commission even forces us to give up our immortality. Hmm. How pitiful. I do not blame you for your ignorance. We were not born in the era when the Ambrosial Arbor first descended. Nor did we witness its miracles. But now, we now have an opportunity to restore the ancient laws. Okay, but maybe it's not the time to live with like ancient laws. <laughs> Forgive me for thinking you might have harbored some profound enlightenment. Yours is the same old talk of those who seek power and give up on their humanity. Mm. Our Sienjo ancestors fought side by side with the Arbiter, laid waste to the Arbor, and established the Ten Lords Commission to lay down the lines between life and death. In doing so, we enshrined our future as human beings. Okay. Celestials? There are no Celestials on the Sien Joe. The divine miracles of the Abundance, the manipulation of life and death. Your deeds are nothing but evil. I have nothing to say to you, Master Diviner. You have already made your decision. You have discarded power. A most foolish choice. I don't know about that. Power is not everything, Allow you know. To show you what the celestials were capable of. And most of the people who have power, they don't use their, their powers chains. for like good stuff, you know. Disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. There's always a weakness. Lend me your strength. What? I'll end your misery. Because all of the people who have the power to change something for the better or help other people, they don't do it, you know? People who have the chance to help others with money or something like that, oftentimes the people that have a lot of money, they don't help anyone, you know? They're just living their rich lives. No offense to rich people though, but sometimes it's just, I don't know. I need to be brief. Annihilate. So you won't protect everyone too. Okay, I forgot to heal. 
But we have a healing... A healing... Healed. <laughs> Can't even talk Challenge anymore. Misery. <laughs> Disappear among the sea of butterflies. I always forget, like, to for press this. E for the next... Um, for the next... I can't do Lend that me your strength. Why am I what even trying? <laughs> I'll see you off. <laughs> your assistance is timely. We've entered okay, the storm. let's go. Let's create another healing defense. field. Crush them. Eternal sleep. The dead return! Target threat index. Lord. Recovered from break? Why? Don't mess with me. Who's next? This battle is unavoidable. Do we have like two waves? Where do I see if I have two waves? You chose the wrong enemy. <laughs> I'm not afraid of you. Annihilate. So you are a <laughs> I need to see if I can build oh I oh. You can use abilities. Wait, what the Diva? Oh, my life is decreased. You'll pay for this. I'll free you from your disappear among the sea of okay. butterflies. Let's buff everyone. To guard and defend, crush them. Imagine being level eighty and doing this Receive like real ability. quick, <laughs> and I'm just here. Reaper. Oh shit. Boom. Thanks. As you come back. Entangle. <laughs> Stay back, Clara. <laughs> Who's next? This battle is unavoidable. Oh boy. Receive divinity. Your assistance is timely. Hey. Eternal sleep. The dead return. This sucks. You'll pay for this. Lend me your strength. What a headache. Who's next? Your life's <laughs> Shut up. Disappear among the sea of butterflies. I'm struggling. Illusions of the past. How am I supposed to kill the big lady? <laughs> the ambrosial arbor's descent will bring us undying bodies. She looks good. The one who gave us the Stellaron. Said that. Who gave you the Stella Ron? Pantelia. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus have fulfilled Pantelia. our promise. Was that the big one? You, Lord Ravager, must do the same. Now, quickly. Lord Ravager? Little pawn. Must you force me to intervene directly? I'm loath to flout my philosophy of destruction. What? No. No, 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 no. No. We like Tingyun. Are you kidding me? We like Ting Yun and now she's a betrayer? No, I can't handle this. What is happening? Never mind. It would seem the time has come for other means of dismantling the Xianzhou from within. Ting Yun? I don't understand. What the hell? <sighs> what a shame. Uh. It would have been nice to observe for a little longer. <laughs> you received the gift of abundance. Surely you can stand the blessing of destruction. Uh, Mr. Yoon! <laughs> huh? Benefactors, allow me to reintroduce myself. I am Lord Ravager Fantilia. I have come with a single purpose. To set in motion the self-destruction of the Sienjo. 
What? The Lord Ravager of the Antimatter Legion? But how can that be? Wait, what? This is a formidable enemy. The Antimatter Legion? What are they doing here? What the fuck is happening? Ting Yun. What the fuck? You'll pay for this. Lend me your strength. Uh, what the hell is going on? So Tingyun is actually not real or what? I don't understand. Insufficient skill price. Fuck me. Don't mess with me. Receive divinity. Your assistance is timely. Okay. Eternal sleep. Return. This is a heavy topic. There's always a weakness. Yeah, well. I'll see you off. Bloom. Thanks. The struggles of underleveled Honkai Star experience. Unavoidable. Whatever. I didn't even Lend know how my strength. sentence started. <laughs> Who's next? I'm so shocked. What I'll the hell? We've entered the storm. To guard and defend. Crush them. I'll free you from disappear among the sea of butterflies. Illusions of the past. You are fortunate that Zephro and Selenova never set their gaze upon the Sienjo. Who's Zephro and Selenova? They have no qualms about dealing out destruction by their own hand. Who but are these people? Since that keeper? stubborn general of yours has forced me to take center stage, I'll make sure I steal the show. <laughs> <laughs> My apologies for leaving so soon. But I have an appointment to keep. I'm sure my friends here will be happy to entertain you. you Shut up. Receive divinity. Your assistance is timely. Hey. Eternal sleep. The dead return. I need to concentrate to get through this. What a headache. <laughs> You'll pay for this. Wrong enemy. <laughs> That is really troublesome. We must no. <laughs> Wait, I have to go through here all over again. Okay. <laughs>